Now let's talk about treating turbinate problems. Medical treatments for enlarged turbinates include antihistamines for allergy control, nasal saline irrigations to clear irritants and reduce nasal inflammation, and nasal steroid sprays such as Flonase to directly reduce surface inflammation and swelling involving the turbinates. Decongestants in pill or nasal spray form should be restricted as short-term use due to the risks of rebound congestion and high blood pressure among other potential health problems. When medications fail, turbinate reduction surgery or turbinoplasty is the best way to increase nasal airflow. While a septoplasty helps even out airflow and in some cases eliminates areas of obstruction such as that created by a large septal bone spur, reducing the volume of the turbinates has an even greater overall impact on airflow through the nose. Resistance for air passing through a tube such as the nose is reduced by the radius of the tube to the fourth power according to this physics principle. Even a slight increase in the radius of the nasal airway significantly improves nasal airflow.